Today, guys, we are opening our final rare car crate from the Battle Pass. This is my last chance to get a Porsche GT3 RS or a Lamborghini Gallardo. We need it to happen now. And yes, I actually did complete all of my tasks this quickly. As you can see, we have completed all our weeklies and all of our daily tasks, and it is literally Saturday just after server restart. So it took me about a day, about 10 hours actually, to complete all of my weeklies and two sets of daily tasks. That is what I call committed. But we did it just because I knew we would have exactly enough to get this car today. So we're opening it and we need to get it. Please, Lord, I'm begging you. If you guys haven't already joined the server before and want to, be sure to click the link down below in the description, click on start playing, select which server you want to play on, register an account and download the launcher. You should be good to go from there. Let's go and pull over somewhere. We'll head on top of this little parking area. The real question is, do I go with what I have been doing this whole time? Each time I've gone for the container in the bottom right hand corner. Do I go with that again? I think we should. All right. Moments of truth. Let's open this thing up. We are going to cover the screen and go over two cars at a time. Here we go, baby. Okay, we're picking the bottom right, by the way. Please, God, don't let the Porsche be in the top left. Are you fucking kidding me? It's actually in the top left again. Oh my God. All right, we got BMW and an R8. No fucking way. Wait, okay. Is that an Enzo or is that the old FXX? I will take that. I will definitely take that. We didn't get the Porsche though. It's literally been in the top left corner every single time. So if you guys want to get a Porsche GT3 RS, just saying it's literally always spawned in the top left every single time, every single time, three crates in a row. I should have just done it. I was even thinking maybe I should go for the top left on my final one and get it. And then I decided, eh, let's not do it. I can't believe this. I honestly cannot believe this. But we did get a Ferrari, which I didn't even know was in there. I feel like that's one of the more rare cars that you can get from this, obviously. Just because, uh, you know, last time we saw the Lamborghini, before we saw like a bunch of BMWs and some crappy SUV. So this is clearly the rare vehicle that you get from this container. And the Porsche, like I said, has been in the top left three times in a freaking row. Oh my gosh. But what did we get? I am very curious. I have a feeling it's the FXX. If it's the Enzo, that is going to be sick. Yeah, it's the FXX. I will take this though. This is a nice car. This is a very nice Ferrari with a state value of $7 million. That's pretty damn expensive. I feel like that's one of the most expensive cars from this container. Kind of wish I didn't sell my uh, other FXX, to be honest, or the FXXK. I had one of those and then I sold it to the state because it was worth like 20 million or something like that. But this is still a beauty. Let's go paint it red. Park it right next to our F40. Every single one of our Ferraris is painted a nice red. We're probably going to go with a more classic red on this one, though. Just like the F40, we're not going to go super bright. Color of transport, straight to red. Neon, let's drop it down to like right there. And that's it. That's all we're doing. Don't need to put anything else on it at the moment. Nice red Ferrari. Look at this beauty. I still am a little disappointed that I did not get a freaking Porsche. Because there is no other way to get it except from opening containers. But I would have much rather gotten it for free, to be honest. I mean, technically this car is just like that as well. I believe there's an actual crate for this car where it's the main car you get in the crate. So I'm kind of happy about that. Oh, by the way, if you guys notice, my screen is a little bit wavy. Uh, I did have to drink nine glasses of wine. So uh, my bad for that. Oh, that is a lot brighter than I thought it was. I thought it was going to be more like that red, but uh, we'll change that up later. But I am happy with this. I am genuinely happy. We got a car that I am okay with. If I got another BMW, I would have screamed. Or if I got a shitty SUV, I would have screamed. We got something nice. We got something that I have not seen pop up in that container before. So I'm genuinely happy. I'm hoping that you guys can get some insane vehicles as well. Let me know down below in the comment section, what is the craziest vehicle that you have seen from this container? We got a $7 million Ferrari from it, and it's not even the rarest container. Because the next one that you guys will see me open is this one, which I'm calling the Epic Container. I'm assuming there's going to be 12 to $15 million cars in this one, which is going to be sick. Then we get the Jamera, 
And then we go straight from that container on over to the legendary one with a black series on there. I think that's a, no, that's, that's like different than a black series. That's like next level or something. And then after that, we get another epic container, legendary, another level four backpack and a Pagani, which is going to be awesome. Man, oh man, 50 levels away. We are getting close and we are going to get to it, guys. We are going to get to it. But we are still quite a ways away from even getting the super one. 12 levels we need to go up. I'm assuming next time weekly tasks come out, we should be just about there. We got what? Five days left of getting about 18,000 XP per day, which is about 6.1 levels. And then we're going to have six new weekly tasks on the Thursday, which literally means... As soon as we're done our weekly tasks next time, we will have the epic car container. Cannot wait. So stay tuned for that video. But anyways, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Let me know what you think of my little teddy bear here. And I will catch you guys in the next one.